What's up guys, welcome back to another Fallout 76 video. This time, we're heading to the far east of the map to Pylon V13 to farm it for a whole hour. There's three enemies in particular we want to kill. One's a behemoth, and there is two super mutants which are known as the bosses of the area. So let's jump into it. Be facing the uh, pylon itself. Now if we look to our left as we come in and use our vats we should be able to find the first super mutant which is just over here as you can see he's got a crown next to his name and that's what we're targeting we're targeting the super mutants with the crowns a bit of lag there but never mind um so let's quickly take this guy out shouldn't take a moment um, He's down and out. Okay, so we get three caps. Missiles, if we want them. I'm not taking them because of weight, though. A bobby pin, a diluted radaway, rib cage, and pelvis. And then, not far from here, is going to be the epic behemoth. Um, again, he's got a crown next to his name, which only means he'll drop more for us. So, let's kill him. Won't take me too long, hopefully. There we go. And um, again, we got a uh, 50.308 rounds, um, 27 caps, 5 bolts, 0.44 ammo, 5.56 ammo, a frag grenade, um, a diluted rad away, some weaponry, some uh, nuclear waste, a ball peen hammer, um, scissors, and that's it because we're not going to take all this even though you can and I'll show you why you can in a moment it isn't going to weigh you down too much simply because there is a weapons workbench I think it's a weapons workbench or an armor workbench right over here at the pylon now the pylon does normally have a few um, enemies spawn around it so why it hasn't I don't know but normally you got gulpers or uh, fog crawlers spawning around here um, there's the weapons workbench in case you want to uh, scrap all the weaponry and armor the behemoth drops. But um, yeah, that's about it. There should be another super mutant knocking about which has the crown next to its name. But if you can't find it straight away, don't worry because you're only going to waste time. Um, I'm going to farm this place for an hour and see what we get. So... I'll see you in an hour guys okay guys so that's the hour up and we have looted it for an hour and i'm going to show you what we got um so let's begin with weapons we got three baseball grenades the board which i'm going to drop because we don't want uh two float and nasha grenades nine frag grenades a molotov eight plasma grenades and a plasma mine onto the armor we got probably nothing uh we got those which we don't actually want. Um, food and drink we've got a bit of. We've got free angler meat. Which was from around by the pylon. Um, one thing I didn't mention is there is another area boss within that region. It's either a fog crawler, an angler, a snallygaster or a fog crawler. Or did I just say fog crawler? I don't know. But yeah, that's what you can get. Um, let's continue anyway. We got a beer, we got black water brew, we got bubble gum, free canned dog food, cotton candy bites, fancy lads, snack cakes, funnel cake, uh, free glow meat, oak hola lager, uh, two preserved insta mash, uh, one purified water, which I won't actually drink because we love. Um, we got nine raw fog crawler meat, uh, two Salisbury steaks, and a sugar bomb onto the aid because the spit of meat food and drinking um nothing special <laughs> okay we got two buffets one buff tats uh two day trippers three medex one psycho one radex seven diluted radex uh one radaway ten diluted radaways um we got about 20 stim packs i did have some of them in my inventory before I started, so we got about 20 stim packs. We got a super stim pack also. Uh, miscellaneous, I don't think, except for the gunpowder, 
I don't think there's anything in here we got from doing so. No, there isn't. Um, and we're going to go on to notes. This is where some of the money comes into it now. You can sell these in your vendors. Um, I ain't too sure for how much. I've had a look online. Some people are saying 30 to 50 caps per map. But um, obviously you can use the maps and loot the uh, treasure, treasure site itself. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 okay we got 11 maps so that's like a 500 plus caps if you sell them in your vendor um we'll ignore the junk for now uh we did get quite a bit of ammo when you look at it we got 90.308 ammo um 214.38 13.44 150.50 uh 56 10 mil uh 5 2 mil uh, 298 5.56 now this is also where you're going to earn your money on your uh, ammo especially with the five mil i've earned over well nearly two and a half thousand caps with just five mil rounds and you get them off the super mutants um anything that's carrying a minigun or a rocket launcher make sure you kill them because they can drop it um let's move on anyway we've got 10 arrows two cannonballs 16 bolts uh, five cryo cells, 59 fuels. That's also something you can get a lot of. We did in this run though, but you can. Uh, we got 100 fusion cells, three fully loaded fusion cores, six missiles, which I'm not going to bother with because they're hard to sell. Um, three plasma cartridges, 24 shotgun shells, and five syringe ammo. So we've done pretty good there. I mean, just looking at what we've got here. We've got um, well over 3,000 caps worth of ammo there. And then obviously you got whatever else we had. Um, you can sell them for quite a bit. I should imagine you're going to make anywhere between four and 5,000 caps per hour here. And don't forget we've also got our uh, junk. So we've got 57 bone, three cloth, one copper, two cork, one crystal. One fertilizer, one fiber optics, two gears, uh, one glass, 17 lead, 12 leather, 7 oil, 8 plastic, uh, 3 rubber, 1 screw, 1 spring and 24 steel. And remember if you do pick all the armor and the weaponry up you can come back to this uh, weapons workbench and scrap it all. Um, there is a plan next to the weapons workbench if you want it also. Um, but yeah that's about it guys there isn't too much more to say about this area you do occasionally get a legendary I did an in that run um, you also occasionally get a scorch beast flying overhead um, but yeah that's about it guys so please guys if you want between four and five thousand caps per hour come to pylon v13 it is one of the better um, spots to loot and you haven't got no Scorch Beasts really there. You haven't got your Scorch Beast Queen or your um, Wendigo Colossus. So it's just a matter of killing things. It's nothing difficult. Um, yeah, there you go. So please subscribe, guys. And please drop a like on the video. And I'll see you all on the next one. See you later, guys. Thank <laughs> you.